question number six is, is a heat pump cheaper to run than a gas boiler? And this very much depends on how much you pay for your gas and how much you pay for your electricity. So if I look at today's figures in June 2022, I can buy my gas for about 8.5 pence for each unit or each kilowatt hour. Now gas boilers, even the super duper new ones, are only about 90% efficient. So you put your 8.5 pence worth of gas into the front of the boiler, light it, and off you go. But not all of it ends up in the house. About 10% goes out of the chimney. So if we work out how much a kilowatt hour of heat actually costs, we need to put a little bit more than one unit into the boiler to get that kilowatt hour of heat out. And if you do the maths, you take your 8.5 pence worth of gas, divide it by the efficiency of 0.9, and your heat costs you 9.4 pence for every kilowatt hour of heat. Now to make maths easier going on in this sector, I'm going to times that up by three to tell you how much three kilowatt hours of heat costs. So in that case, it's going to cost us just under 30 pence for three kilowatt hours of heat. So if we now compare the cost of that gas that we talked about of just under 30 pence for three kilowatt hours of energy, and we compare that with direct electric heating. So this is a little electric oil-fired radiator or those little blower fans that you can buy from all of the shops. Electricity today is 33 pence per kilowatt hour, so much more expensive than gas. All electric heating systems are 100% efficient, so for every little bit of energy you put in the front, you get heat out. So if I'm paying 33 pence for one kilowatt hour of electricity, it means I'm paying 33 pence for one kilowatt hour of heat from that electrical heater. Again, like I did with the gas boiler, if we times it up for how much does three kilowatt hours of heat cost, it's pretty easy. Today, it's 99 pence. So roughly three and a bit times as expensive as your gas boiler. So very, very cheap to buy the original, initial equipment, but very, very expensive to run. When we're talking about a heat pump, it's the same maths, but it's a slightly more complicated process. So with your heat pump, we are gonna use electricity, which again, we pay 33 pence per kilowatt hour for. We stick that into the front of the heat pump, which is driving the motor or the compressor. But what the heat pump does is it harvests free energy from the garden. That's the renewable part of the equation. So typically with a heat pump system, for every one unit of electricity you put into the front, we can gather two kilowatt hours of free energy from the garden. So if we think about that and we do the maths again, I'm gonna put one unit of energy in the front, that cost me 33 pence. I'm getting two free units from the garden, so I am gonna supply the house with three kilowatt hours of heat for 33 pence. Little bit more today than the gas boiler, enormously cheaper than direct electric heating. So today, is a heat pump cheaper than gas? Using the figures I said today, a heat pump is very, very marginally more expensive. Of course, if you were to go for a tariff from somebody like Tesla, where they're paying uh, only 10 or 11 pence per kilowatt hour, it's enormously cheaper to use a heat pump than it is to use any other form of heat. So quite often when you go for your heat pump choice, we ask you to look at tariffs which really favour electricity. If you can get your electricity price down with reference to gas, savings can be made which are very significant. <music>